Welcome back, everybody. What I'm doing today is something super cheap, super easy. Um, what I have here is two giant bulbs from Walmart. I think they're like seven bucks, eight bucks. Uh, the one on the left is the way they come. It's got just one giant bulb inside of it. The one on the right here is what I've done to it. All I've done is opened it up, took out the one giant bulb and put in this string of blue lights, it's a blue bulb. Um, I'm gonna do the same to the green one. I've got a string of 100 green lights and then I've got one red too. We're gonna hang them in the tree out front, but I'm gonna be replacing them all over. Take that one bulb out and put in all of these. Just stuff them down in there and screw the cap back on. Um, there is a few screws that have to be taken out. I'll show you that here in just a second. But overall, it's a simple thing. It takes me like five minutes. And in my opinion, it makes it look a heck of a lot better. So, I'll grab the next one and get to working on it and show you what I'm talking about. Okay, so when you get it opened up, here's what it looks like. There's three Phillips screws in here, one in each of these holes. One, two, three. All three of those need to come out. Once those are out, this piece will pull out of here. You'll have two pieces, this threaded piece and this inner insert. When you get that out of there, just cut this zip die. I'm going to do that now, and then I'll get back to you guys and show you what to do from there. Okay, so here we are. We're back now. We got our two pieces, light stretched out, laid across the floor. What you're going to want to do now, and it's easier to do it this way first, because we're going to put this cap back together. So we're going to take our plug in, push it through the hole. Pull some slack into it. And now we're going to do the same thing with the other. Feed them through the hole one at a time. Pull some slack through it. And then what we're going to need to do is take this piece, line these tabs up with these inside of here, and we're going to take one side of the cord and put it in the recess on this side. The other side of the cord will be in the recess on the other side. But when you do it, you have to line those tabs up on the inside because that's where the screws go. Okay, so here we are. We're back now. Caps back together. Two pieces hanging out. Um, what I like to do is stretch it all the way out. Even. Um, it comes pretty balled up. Has a tendency to want to be balled up. And then from there, what I do... I grab the end. And then just... Straighten it back into the ball nice and even then put the cap back on tighten it back down done deal so just like that keep feeding it back through so this is the end result in all three colors um it's just a much better effect in my opinion number one uh Number two, the LEDs are going to last longer, and they're cheaper to run. So, I think it's an improvement all the way around. Super cheap, super simple. Um, thanks for watching. Um, I try to get around and do things and post uh, as much as possible. But, like I said, this is kind of just a little hobby on the side things I like to do, thought I'd share it with you guys. Thanks for watching.
Until next time.